What's up guys, it's Gab CTMs back with another video and today I have a little bit of a throwback Thursday for you guys. I have a 2020 pro debut hobby box and I'm pretty excited because I've never actually opened a box of minor league product before. I've only opened a couple packs here and there and some subscription boxes that I've opened on the channel. So I'm really excited. There are four guaranteed hits in this so hopefully we find something good. So let's get into it. Trying not to destroy the, oh I destroyed the pack. Hold on. Let me do this off camera. I always keep the boxes of stuff I, I open and I try not to destroy them on camera. That didn't work too well. Okay. Here we go. And I'm not 100% familiar with this checklist just because I'm not a huge fan of minor league products, but Hopefully we can get something good. Here are the odds. And let's get into it. So we have a Kirilov, Nunez, Nate Pearson. He's a pretty good one. Michael Bush. A, an insert here, ready for flight, Sixto Sanchez. That's pretty cool. And I love how the, uh, the surface looks on these minor league cards. It's different. It's kind of like a matte finish here with the, the player in the middle. Kind of like a, a glossy finish there. Um, Joe Adele and Logan Davidson. And forgive me if I mispronounce any names. Like I said, I'm not too familiar with everybody in this set. Or if I miss something, just let me know. We got Thompson, Forrest Whitley, JJ Ghost. I think we have an autograph here. Well, we already saw it, so let's just flip it over. We have Gus Varland. I'm not too sure who that is. Looks like he was drafted in 2018 by the Athletics. Pretty nice, our first hit right there. Kyle Muller, Joey Cantillo, and I'm not even sure how to pronounce that one. And Mackenzie Gore. I'm hoping for the cover boy, JJ Vlade, but I'm not sure if we'll get one of his hits. Kendall Williams, Ian Anderson. We have a nice tape measure power, Sam Huff insert right there. And Austin Hansen. One of the main reasons why I got this too was because I send a lot of TTM and my league guys send to, tend to sign a lot of TTM. So I figured with the base that I get with this, I could send out a lot and get some signatures too. Josh Young, Jimenez, Reese Hines, Julio Rodriguez, and Kelly. So a couple packs in, we have our first autograph hit so far. There's two autographs, and then there's two additional hits, which could be relics or autographs or autographed relics. We have Gus Varland, who was our first autograph. Casey Mize. And Braden Shumik is the last one. I'm so reluctant to say all of these names because I'm not familiar with these guys, and I know I'm going to butcher a lot of it. We have Corbin Carroll, Ethan Small, Shirt and Apostle, I'm pretty sure that's a good one, Riley Green, and a nice Anthony Volpe, prospect for the Yankees who does sign TTM. I wonder how much of the set I can complete with this hobby box. Ronnie Mauricio, Lula Marquez, there's JJ Belay, the cover boy. Jaron Duran, we have a nice insert here of Jose Gomez. Damon Jones, and Zach Thompson. A lot of these names that I see, I've actually gotten or know that they do sign TTM, so I think this was a good idea. I'll send these cards out for sure. 
Alec Manoa. Neil Vargas. Brett Beatty. Aaron Ashby. And Adley Rutschman, number one overall pick in the 2019 draft. I think Rutschman's going to be a stud in a couple years when they call him up. So we've opened a couple packs since our first hit and nothing yet, so. Got another Yankee right there. Jackson Rutledge, Luis Patino, Will Wilson, a Royce Lewis ready for flight insert. That's pretty cool. Hunter Bishop. Hopefully we get a hit in this next pack. This does feel a little thick. We have something in here for sure. Jeez, that's huge. What is this? Do we have a book? No. Oh, it was turned the wrong way. I thought that was a book. We have Adam Hall, Fragments of the Farm. What even is that? I have no idea what that is. It is so thick. I mean, I have no idea what this relic even is. Oh, season tickets? That's a little weird. Tickets as our relic. Alrighty there. That was really weird. It's probably the thickest relic I've ever pulled. You could even call that a relic. It's literally just tickets, but... Quinn Priester. Andrew Vaughn. Seth Johnson. This one feels a little thick. Oh, well, maybe not. Adam Hall, the guy we just pulled that season ticket of. We have a nice Foster Griffin insert right there. I like the look of these. These are really nice, that insert design. That's a really cool shirt. Loving the tie-dye. Nolan Gorman, Alec Marsh. I wonder if Luis Roberts in this set. I, I would assume so. Like I said, I literally have never seen the checklist for this. I've only opened one pack of this in a subscription box, but Josh Wolf, Joe Waters, Jeter Downs, and there's another hit. We have Alec Marsh. That's a name I've heard of before, so I think that's a pretty good drafted number. Oh yeah, that's a really good one. He was drafted second overall by the Royals in 2019, so that's a pretty good name right there. Nice hit. I'll take it. And we have O'Neill Cruz as our last one there. So three hits so far. We have one more. Hopefully it's an autograph, but it's probably going to be a relic. Make Magical. A nice ready for flight Matt Manning insert. Have we seen any gold cards yet? I don't think we've seen any gold or like colors. Base card parallels, blue is one in 20, green is one in 30. Oh, so the golds are not exactly easy to pull. And it's not easy to see the colors on this card either because of the design, the way it's just on the outer corner like that. We have a tape measure power Adley Rutschman insert. That's a pretty cool one. L. Hall, Josh Smith, and Nolan Jones. Yeah, I don't think we've hit any color for the base, but I go through this so quickly that I might have missed something. We have a nice Royce Lewis on the back there. Bobby Dalvik. Oh, nice. There we go. Release Robert. Insert right there. Love that card. Going straight into my Robert PC. Alec Thomas, and Royce Lewis. Can you imagine if we pulled a Louis Robert autograph out of this? That'd be crazy. If I can, I'm going to try to save our last hit for the last pack. 
but it's really hard to tell if there's an autograph in this pack. It's just the same thickness and the cards just flipped over, but Victor Mesa Jr. Nice jersey right there. Oh, we have our first color and it is Brady Singer, a blue, number to 150. That's a really good one. Brady Singer was number one overall in 2018. That's pretty good. Really? That doesn't sound right. The first, no, that doesn't sound right. Maybe it was, it was probably drafted in the first round by the Royals, not number one overall. That definitely is not right. I'm gonna have to look that up later. Tristan McKenzie, Joey Bart, and Edward Cabrera. Let me just put that blue over there. Maybe, I'm like so confused right now. I haven't followed the draft for very long. 2019 draft is when I really started paying attention. Um, I'm not sure about that 2018 draft. Let's see. Oh, there's a nice Wanda Franco. Number one prospect for the Rays. Put that in a good pile, just because I don't have many Wander cards. Jonathan India. We have a few packs to go. We have one, two, three, four, five, six packs to go with one hit remaining. I'd like to get another color. That would be cool. But they're not exactly easy to pull. Alec Baum. A Nick Magical ready for flight insert. That's a pretty good one. Tim Tebow. <laughs> I actually saw him at spring training last year, and he did so bad. He struck out, and he was getting a huge round of booze, and I recorded it. It was really funny. But... Matt Wallner. TJ Sykema for the Yankees. I love these jerseys, the tie-dye jerseys. And Glenn Allen Hill Jr. Four packs left, one hit to go. Matt Manning. Victor 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 Mesa. Not Victor Mesa Jr. Victor Victor Mesa. We have a gold here of Jeter Downs. Number to 50. Oh wow. The golds are numbered to 50 instead of 2020 like they are in the regular set. That's pretty cool. Nice low number. Josiah Gray, Ryan Mountcastle. I think. No. I thought that one might have felt thick. Dalton Varsho. Another Wonder. What was the first one we got of Wonder Franco? I'm not sure if there's any short prints in this. Like I said, I, I'm going into this completely blind. So we got two different Wonder Franco cards here. I wonder if one's a short print. We got this one, and then we got the sideways one. Let me look, look at the numbers. This one ends in 81. This one ends in 95. I think we might have a short print on our hands, guys. Let me look. 81. 81. Okay, so 81 is the regular base card. And I'm going to assume that this is a short print. That's pretty cool. If you're going to get a short print, Wander Franco is a really good name to get one of. That's really awesome. Wilfred Acedillo. Shane Baz. Nick Lodolo. Yeah, a lot of these guys signed TTM. So I'm going to send out a lot of these. Maybe for spring training. We've got two packs left. I'm trying to see if I could tell. None of these feel like they have a relic in it. I hope they didn't short us a hit. see oh we have an autograph in this pack okay so i'll save that one for last so we did end up getting three autographs which is pretty cool because that relic was absolutely atrocious who wants a season ticket as a relic it wasn't even touched by them it wasn't worn by them like that's ridiculous daniel johnson insert there logan gilbert and on to our final pack i'm going to put the hit in the back off camera just so we have a little bit of suspense. And I flipped it over. I promise I'm not looking, but I flipped it over. Okay. Luis Garcia. Hubert Ruiz. And do we have one more or two? Oh, one more card. 
All right. So we have, it's a blue. It's a Marlin. It is Cameron Meisner. Number to 150. Marlins. I'm guessing he was drafted in the first round of the 2019 draft. Pretty cool name right there. Numbered 150. Nice low number. So I'll do a quick recap of my favorite cards from this break here. We have Gus Varland autograph. Now, I don't want to spend too much time on this, but I'm trying to figure out the drafted, if it's number 14 or if it's in the 14th round. I'm going to go look that up. <laughs> we have a Gus Varland autograph. We have a Cameron Meisner blue to 150. We have our Wander Franco, just a base card, Wander Franco. And then we have what seems to be a short print of Wander Franco. I'm going to go look that one up right away. Our Jeter Downs, number to 50, gold. Our Brady Singer, blue, number to 150. Our Luis Robert insert right there. Our Alec Marsh autograph. And our weird relic looking thing, season ticket, Fragments of the Farm, Adam Hall. So thank you guys so much for watching. That was a lot of fun. Hopefully this giant stack I have right here can get me a bunch of TTMs and hopefully I can complete the set because that would be pretty cool. If I have a couple cards to go, I'll probably just complete that set and stash it away. Um, thank you guys so much. Leave comments if I missed anything or if you want to explain the draft to me, you know, anything, any feedback is appreciated. Um, once I hit 100 subscribers, I'm going to be giving away a couple of fat packs on Instagram. So if you want to check that out, go to Gab's TTMs, the same as here on Instagram. I'll be giving away a few fat packs on Instagram. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much and I'll see you guys again soon.